good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm out on a walk today and uh, I couldn't help but I walked past this a minute ago and I decided to come back. I couldn't help but stop and just look at this little, uh, this river here. First of all, hey, my name is Dave. I'm a Christian recording artist and a worship leader and a writer of devotions and a follower of Jesus. And uh, every Saturday I release these videos that talk about God and Jesus and what they mean to us and what it looks like in our lives. And I was walking past this kind of gentle stream brook and couldn't help but not think about we had some rain last night here and so the river is a little more active than uh, than it usually is and so I couldn't help but think about Psalm 23 and uh, where it says the Lord is my shepherd he'll lead us to green pastures and lead us beside still waters and I was looking up a little bit about just some commentary on uh, what that all means. And there actually wasn't very much commentary. It was pretty basic, <clears throat> which I kind of like. It's this simple message that in the midst of our uh, struggle, in the midst of our desires and in the midst of our needs, uh, God knows what we need. He is the shepherd. We are the sheep, right? He knows what we need. He knows to lead the sheep to green pastures where they need rest. And he knows to lead the sheep to still waters where they need refreshment, right? And nourishment. And I love the idea of the father being the shepherd, us being the sheep, because we, we're here to follow Jesus, right? That's, that's, our, that's our call. And so we follow Jesus and he leads us to green pastures. He leads us to still waters. And sometimes we as uh, humans, as people, sometimes we say, uh, I think I know what I need today. And I think I know that I need, um, you know, this or that or the other thing. I need to go see a movie or I need, I'm just trying to make up stuff here. I need to go to, uh, this store to satisfy the need that I have to, I don't know, spend some money and, um, and that'll make me feel better. But meanwhile, if we really have put our faith and our trust in the Father, He says, uh, I am your shepherd, you are the sheep, and I lead you beside still waters. I lead you to green pastures because I know that you need this. Right? I know that you need to be led to green pastures where you can rest, where your mind isn't so active. I know that you need to be led to still waters so that you can experience the stillness of the water, the stillness of the, the there's a peace that you sometimes experience when you're by um, a little river like this, right? It's not, I mean, just look at the way it's flowing, right? Okay, so let me walk back this way. And uh, I'm looking at it down here. It's, it's a pretty straight river. And then there's this little bend here and it kind of funnels into this, you know, into this more rapid section. And then after the funnel, it steadies out again. And so just thinking about like life, right? So a lot of times we like beyond that funnel, it's pretty peaceful. And then the funnel happens and something happens in life that takes us uh, off 
gets us riled up a little bit, gets us moving in a way that maybe we didn't want to move, and then it it levels out again and it becomes peaceful again. And God is wanting us to, he's wanting to lead us to these peaceful waters so that we can experience uh, his peace, his joy in the midst of our struggles and our turmoil. So today, this, I'm not going to lean too much more into this because it's pretty simple, but, and I'm sure I've spoken about Psalm 23 before, but I just wanted to talk about it again because we need to be led to green pastures. We need to be led to still waters because our lives are in such turmoil sometimes that we need to just stop and just take a breath, take a rest and just say, God, you are my shepherd. You lead me to green pastures. You lead me to still waters. So today, slow down. Let God lead you to a green pasture. Let him lead you to still waters so that you can stop and just experience this in your mind and in your body and so that God can just continue to speak to us as we slow down and let him in. And just kind of just meditate on that those first few verses in Psalm 23 today. Just let him give you breath, right? Give you life, and just give you peace as you experience the still waters and the green pastures that he leads you to. Okay? Mm, amen. God, it's so awesome. So, so awesome. What a beautiful little spot this is. We're supposed to get some rain, but um, I decided to come out on a walk a little early and, uh, and just be led to these still waters. It's beautiful. All right. Thanks for joining us. Head over to joindaysband.com to get involved in our membership and get more access to Bible studies and devotions and a community of people that are coming together to learn and seek Jesus every single day. Uh, it costs less than your Netflix subscription. Uh, but our membership saves and changes lives, and that's what we want to do together. All right? Thanks for being here. We'll see you guys on the next one. Take care.